Hi, Miss Nona here, the story lady, and I'm so happy to see you this week, boys and girls. As you notice, I still have my friends from the summer reading program. Hello, I'm Princess Paperback, and this is my friend, Bookmark. And I'm Jeffrey! You didn't mention me! Yes, well, I was getting to that, Jeffrey, but you interrupted me. Well, I'm Jeffrey, the library dragon, and you'll have to excuse me, but I'm a little nervous this week. I only have two weeks to complete my reading log. Well, that's plenty of time, Jeffrey. You've been reading all summer. I know, but I'm just so afraid. Do you know any magic? Do you know magic? Oh, if Sir Read a lot were here, he would just read to me. It will be fine, Jeffrey. I don't know where Sir Read a lot is yet, but we'll be all right. You'll get it done in plenty of time for the, for the finish of it. You think so? I know so. You're a very fast reader, and you enjoy it. All right. Well, I guess we're going to read a book about magic this week, A Little Fairy. Yes, we are. Yes, we are, and you will like it. I don't think she knows everything she's supposed to know yet, but it's a good story. Today's book is called Alice the Fairy. It's by David Shannon. Do you think she's a real fairy? I guess we'll find out. My name is Alice. I'm a fairy. I'm not a permanent fairy. I'm a temporary fairy. You have to pass a lot of tests to be a permanent fairy. I have wings so I can fly. I can't fly very high yet, but I can fly really fast. She looks fast. She looks fast to you, Bookmark? I think you think so too. This is my magic wand. This is my blanket. Fairies use magic wands to change frogs into princes and things like that. I changed my dad into a horse. That looks like fun. One time my mom made cookies for my dad. Yum, yum. So I turned them into mine. She's going to have a tummy ache. bad about the cookies, so I thought I'd whip up a new outfit for my dad. Did I tell you he's the Duke of Morningside Drive? Well, he is. She made him golden sparkly pants and purplish pink shoes. That's Alice's favorite color. And plaid velvet shirt. Would your dad wear something like that? Maybe. But clothes were too hard, so I made him a new crown instead. That's really cool. I bet you could make a crown like that. With my magic wand, I can make leaves fall from the trees. Hmm, I bet you can too. And I can draw pictures on water. Sometimes I use my wand to disappear. What's she doing with her wand? Is that the light switch? <gasps> But that's kind of scary. It is scary in the dark. I'd rather use my blanket. Is she disappeared, do you think? Alice, you're silly. Of course, I always have also have a magic mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairiest of them all? Well, what do you know? It's me. Alice. Hmm. Thank you, Mirror. Fairy dust is very useful. I use it to turn oatmeal into cake. Oh, look at all that sugar. Casting spells is another important part of being a fairy. Watch me make my dog float on the ceiling. Hocus pocus, croak and docus. Is he on the ceiling? Hauken, Tauken, Riggin, Falcon! Poof! Still not on the ceiling. Doggin, Floggin, Biddle, Noggin! Hmm. Okay. That one needs a little work. She couldn't get the dog to float. But a fairy must be very careful with magic. Once I accidentally turned my white dress into a red one. Oh no. That made the Duchess so mad she locked me in the tower forever. I got away, though. Who do you think the Duchess is? Maybe 
be its mom. A fairy's life is filled with danger. Broccoli is often poisoned by the wicked duchess and should never be eaten. Oh, I don't know. I like broccoli. It's pretty good. And it's good for you, too. Fairies also hate baths. I'd like to turn my bath water into strawberry jello. That would be fun. But I don't know how yet. You have to be a permanent fairy to do tricks like that. They go to advanced fairy school and learn how. Look at Bookmark. Look at the castle. I'm supposed to learn how to make clothes get off the, off the floor and dance around and line up in the closet. I would like to know that trick, too. I'm not very good at that, though. Looks like she'd rather eat grapes than read a book. Sounds like fun to me. I'll probably be a temporary fairy forever. Oh, look out, Bookmark. She's going to try to turn a frog into something else. <gasps> Ooh. The end.